What's going on? It's hump day. We are back for another day. It's turned to be. You have it inside. We just got to get it out. I want to talk to you about getting to the next level. Getting to the point in your life where you want to be, where you want to be exceptional. Not just one person in the crowd, but you want to stand out in the crowd. You want to be the person, you want to be the man, you want to be the woman that makes the difference, that stands out, that makes the winning home run, that makes the winning touchdown, that makes the winning shot, that makes the winning pitch for your business. If you want to be that person, listen to me today. You have to live through it. Number one, live through it. Whatever you're going through right now, live through it. I'm not talking about just surviving. But if you were climbing a mountain and you got to the mountain and you slipped and you cut your hand and you said, you know what, my hand is hurt, I'm just going to survive. If you're right in the middle of the mountain and you say, I'm going to survive, then you're not going to make it to the mountain peak. You won't make it to the mountain top. Why? Because you can't just survive. You have to live through it. And when you live through it, when you go through something, it makes you stronger. It makes you wiser. It makes you tougher. It prepares you for the challenge that lays ahead because you're still alive because it's something else for you to do. So don't just don't just say this, I'm going to survive. You got to live through it. Number two, stop saying I'm abused. Stop having an abused mentality. That's right, a victim mentality. Have a victor mentality. You're not being abused. When you come through a problem, don't say this problem is abusing me because you can only be abused when you choose to be abused. But say, how can I use this? How can I learn from it? Everything comes together for your good and to be used for your good. But you gotta have the right perception. You gotta have the right mindset to use it for your good. So don't say I'm being abused. Don't say I'm being attacked. Everybody's being attacked. Everybody's being abused. But you say, how can I use this for my good? How can I grow from this? How can I get stronger? How can I get smarter? How can I apply this to my life to make me better? How can I use this as a stepping stool? It's like you taking blocks and you're taking them blocks and, you, and you're building up, you're building up, you're building up. It's like cement blocks, like building a house. Use your problems. Don't use it to discourage you. Allow it to encourage you. And number three, lastly, number three, lastly, what you have to get in your head right now is that no matter what happens, you have to have the courage to continue. You have to have the courage to continue no matter how down and out you may be, no matter how broke you may be, no matter what your parents said, you have to have the courage to continue. If they told you never, then today is never. That's right. If they said it will never happen, today is your never. This is your opportunity to do everything they said that you could not do. You have to build an inside. Let's get it out.